Hey, thank you for clicking on today's video. If you are new here, hi, my name is Rochelle. I post Christian content all about faith, lifestyle and business. So if you like watching those types of videos, then please consider subscribing. Okay, on to the video. Good morning everyone, welcome to my channel. Guys, I am so excited for today's video because I am filming a day in the life of a small business owner. So this morning I'm going to be making me some French press coffee. Um, I only make this when my mom buys this coffee. Otherwise, I only drink your normal vinegar coffee. What? I'm sorry guys, I don't know why I said vinegar coffee. I was basically saying I usually drink this type of coffee. Oh, and I'm currently editing this video in my robe. So, anyways, onto the video. But guys, today I have a lot of things that I need to do. I'm going to take you guys into the office now if I finish making my coffee and then we're gonna go through everything I need to do but some things that I can tell you now is I have to do a photo shoot. I have to take some photos, some product photos, some new Instagram feed photos. And then I also want to work on some new designs today, some new ideas, um, just brainstorming. And then I also need to do some schoolwork in today's vlog, but we'll get to that. <laughs> Guys, this coffee is next level. It's actually raining outside, which I love the rain. Um, and I'm glad that I've got this camera because it makes the lighting a lot better because it's quite dark. Like, I'm gonna quickly sit outside. So I don't know about you guys, but I literally cannot wait for the day that I can move out, live by myself. Because the only reason I'm able to film this video is because my brother is away at work and then my parents are away for the weekend. So that's the only reason that I can film this over near my house. But genuinely, I, I cannot wait for the day that I can finally move out, but that's still a long way to go. Like, I'm not even 20 years old yet. I'm turning 20 in November, so it's still a long way to go, but really, I cannot wait. So this office that I'm going to be showing you guys right now, it was actually my dad's office. Okay, so this is how it looks when you enter. This is the area where I sit. If you come over here, this table is a little bit of a mess. This area is fine, it's it's organized, so it's fine. And then this area is also organized. But then when you get to this table, it's an absolute mess. Ozzy. So I've got some boxes there, some materials, some random stuff, so. So I think before I can get started on this um, day in the life of a small business owner, I first need to clean this office up. So let's quickly do that. I'm done. So here's this table. This is my packaging orders table. It's all cleaned up. I packed everything away. Um, everything is organized. Let's get started with things I need to do today. So first thing that I have to do today is I have a theology interactive lesson that I need to do today. Then I'm going to be doing a photo shoot. Then I want to check my analytics on an email campaign that I sent out yesterday. Then I need to schedule a YouTube video going up today at 6 p.m. And I also need to send out a story post for the YouTube video. I need to edit a video. And then lastly, I need to wrap up this month. So it's currently the 28th of May. It's a Friday. So I think the last day of this month is Monday, but I'm going to end off the month today. Like all my admin things. This is very exciting because this gives me the chance to set new goals and plan new things for the new month coming. June, I think it's June. It is June, right? July. Isn't it June then July? Oh, it is June. <laughs> So the 1st of June is Tuesday, so I want to have my new goals and everything set up by the end of this weekend. Okay, so I started off with checking my email campaign that I did the previous day. I also responded to some DMs that I had and I posted on my Instagram story because I upload on my story every single day. And then I got most of my theology work done. But guys, then I attempted to do my photo shoot and nothing worked out. Guys, I tried. I really did try. It really didn't work out. None of the photos came out right. And then I attempted to take a thumbnail, which I don't know. Hello, everyone. So I've just worked for two and a half hours and I'm going to take a break now. 
Um, so I completed my lesson and I also wrote a quiz that I was supposed to write on Monday, but I felt prepared enough to write the quiz. So I just wrote it today, which I'm so happy about that. One less thing to do on Monday. It's 12, it's 20 past 12. So I'm going to eat something and then I'll get back to work. <laughs> Okay guys, let me share with you what my lunch is going. Oh, I look. I made my mom a cake for her birthday. This is how it looks. So my lunch, I am not very hungry. So my lunch is going to be a piece of this cake. Um, I'm, not, I'm not that hungry, so I'm not gonna make me something to eat. But I do, you know, I do want something. Hello everyone, it is currently, hold on, quarter past two in the afternoon and I've just spent another hour working. So what I'm going to do now is I am going to spend some time in the Lord's presence now. Now I'm not going to film it, um, but I'm going to share with you like what I do and what I use. So obviously I have to have some nice praise and worship songs. I'll share with you guys my absolute favorite worship song it's not like it's probably not the best song out there there's probably better songs but this song is it just makes me feel some type of way it's called sound of the saints by audio adrenaline and then when i also use when i set out time to spend with the lord it's obviously my bible also this book because obviously when we are in the presence of god um, and we allow the Holy Spirit to move through us. God will speak to us, right? So you want somewhere to write things down. And then I also have my prayer journal that I made last year in quarantine. I made this journal. And then there's some verses in this journal that I just like use. Um, so I'm going to spend some time with the Lord now. I've set out like an hour. I don't really have a scheduled time, but like I've set out like about an hour and then I'm gonna eat but I do want to encourage you guys watching to set out time in your day to spend with the Lord many times in the Bible we read how Jesus he took himself away from the crowd and normally it's a lot of scripture where he says Jesus woke up and rose early in the morning and he went to the hill and he prayed to God so there's many times where Jesus isolated himself to go and spend time with the Lord so it's biblical it's important that we get filled up in the presence and Yo, give God the praise and honor that's due to him. I'm so excited. I love spending time with the Lord. Hello everyone. It's been a long time since I've spoken to you guys last. So let me update you guys on what I've been doing. So last time you saw me, I was spending some time in God's presence. I was busy doing that for about an hour and then I went and took a shower. So then I came to my desk because I am actually uploading a YouTube video tonight at 6 p.m. which is in two hours. So I quickly scheduled the video to go up. And then while I was uploading the video, I actually got an order, which is so exciting. I love when I get orders. So that's exciting. That means you guys can package an order with me. I'll show you what I do. Okay, everyone. So I've got an order right here, all printed out and ready to go. So first thing I do is I grab a tote bag from the shelf. Great. So here's the tote bag um, and then I quality check. Okay, so there's the tote bag and then the heat press is on. There we go. And then as you can see on the software, I am just going to send it to the machine. And then the machine will start.
Okay everyone, so my camera battery is going to shut down any moment now and I still have a lot of things to do. So I'm going to end the video here. And guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you liked this type of video and if you like a day in the life of a Christian entrepreneur, small business owner, then tell me in the comments if you want to see more of these because I can make more. But if you want to support this channel, then like this video. And then also you can find me over on my Instagram. I post on there every day. You can also check out my website. All my links will be in the description box. But yeah, guys, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!